This is Jen Judkins with Teaching Forward. In this tutorial video, we're going to take a look at using non-graded rubrics with Google Classroom. First, we'll show you how to create an assignment and attach a rubric. As part of that, we'll take a look at how to create a new rubric. Then, we'll switch over to Student View to show you how this looks on the student side. And then switch back to Teacher View to show you how teachers use this rubric to grade. Let's get started. When you begin to create the assignment, you need to first add your item that you're assigning and remember to make sure each student gets a copy, then decide where you're assigning it. As an alternative to the points over here, you can create a rubric. When you create a rubric, you can use scoring, but if you want to just use um, words to describe their uh, ranking, you can do that as well. So you could put in like points 0 to 4 and then title that level, or you can flip this off and still use criterion to describe the different levels. You would fill in the title of the rubric, a description for the rubric, and then for as many levels as you have, you would put in a description. Enter the level title, and you would typically add a description so students know what each level corresponds to. All right, so then you can save the rubric. Now, when I am going to grade this, I'll have this available to me. Now, coming into Classroom as the student, you can see I have a new assignment. I can click on the assignment and I can see rubric information here. So let me just back up and go to the classwork page to view that. If I look at it on the classwork page, it provides a little bit better detail and easier to see. I have the rubric as a separate attachment. <clears throat> And if I click on my assignment, it's going to launch my document. Okay, so once the student is in the assignment and completes it, then they would turn it in. I'm returning now to the teacher view of this class. I'm in the classwork page and I'm going to click on the assignment. I can click on assign to see the tiles of all my students' work. Clicking on the assignment will open it in a grading window. Because I attached a rubric, I can see that rubric off to the side here. Then select your rating from the list of choices. And then I can return the work. Thanks for watching. For more help with technology in your classroom, check us out online at teachingforward.net.